Hi guys, I'm Smitha and welcome back to my channel where I talk about all things AI and machine learning related. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about automatic speech recognition and machine learning. What exactly is automatic speech recognition and how is machine learning used to implement it? We're also going to be implementing our own automatic speech recognition using a really cool API built by Assembly AI. Assembly AI is a deep learning company based out of San Francisco, which is focused on doing advanced research into neural networks and machine learning and applying this technology into speech recognition. Now, speech recognition is a growing field within machine learning because if we look at the data that has if we look at the trends of data that we've been observing, we know that audio and video types of data have just been increasing more and more. So definitely as machine learning engineers moving forward, it's extremely important to know how to handle these type of data, like audio or video type of data. So this is why APIs like assembly AI are extremely important. They are actually your first step of actually processing your audio data before you apply it into your machine learning model. By using Assembly AI's API, you are able to actually get a lot of meaning out of your audio data. For example, uh, Assembly AI's API is also able to detect the number of speakers in a particular audio file and also classify the audio according to those speakers. It is also able to detect topics, what type of topics are being addressed in the audio file and also do summarization, which is really important if you want to get a gist of what is being talked about or what is actually being spoken about in an audio file. These type of features are extremely important to have. So let's actually jump into Assembly AI's API. One thing that is also really cool about it is that it has a no code feature. So we're going to start off with that. And the no code feature is extremely useful if you are beginning and you don't really want to dive into the coding aspect, you can definitely go ahead and use this no code feature for perhaps a singular audio file that you have to get some data out of it. So let's actually try that. So guys, to follow along with this tutorial, go ahead and create an account with Assembly AI's website. The link for that is in the description box below. Once you have done that, you can see a home page like this, where there's a bunch of information such as your API key and also uh, links to have a quick start coding option and also a no code option, which is the one we are going to be exploring. So we can try this no code feature here. And for this no code feature, we're actually going to look at the latest Mr. Beast video and let's actually analyze the audio on that. You can also select what type of features you would like if you want to transcribe the full audio file or this, uh, and if you would like speaker labels, if there are multiple speakers in the audio, I'm going to uncheck this because they are not necessary. And we're going to select topic detection and also detect keywords and phrases. And then you can click start transcription. Once your audio file has been transcripted, this is the type of uh, result that you'll get. To look at the full result, you can click view raw result and this is what you'll actually be seeing. So this is actually the text that has gathered from the audio file and it looks at each of the words and also uh, it detects the confidence level at interpreting each of the words and also the speaker as well. So this is an extremely cool and simple way to actually transcribe your audio file. And this is an absolutely code free way. So it's definitely useful for everyone. Even if you don't know how to code, you can definitely use this in order to transcribe any type of audio file that you have. Now that you guys have seen the no code version of how to transcribe an audio file, let's actually look at live transcription of audio. And to do that, you guys have to create an account and get your API key. So be sure to use the link in the description box below to Assembly AI's website where you can actually go ahead and create an account and also use your API key in order to follow along in this tutorial to do live transcription of audio. Where the program that we write is actually going to be transcribing live what we're actually speaking. So it's really cool. So let's get started. Once you guys have created your account on Assembly AI's website, your uh, homepage should look something like this. And this right here is your API key. So you're actually going to need to copy this and paste this in your code. I also be leaving a link to the blog post on assembly AI's website, which is also the full link to this 
tutorial slash guide, which is able to teach you guys how to do real time speech recognition to Py with Python. The first thing that we need to do is actually uh, go ahead and install port audio and Py audio as well as web sockets. Uh, these libraries are extremely important in order for us to run this code. And also step two is getting your assembly AI's API key, which I just showed you guys how you can do that. So let's start by creating a Python file called live text. And if we look at the tutorial, the first thing we got to do is actually import Py audio. And also we need to specify a lot of these constants such as frames per buffer, format, channel, rate, and, and so on. So uh, just copy this from the link. And next up, we actually need to make an asynchronous function that will send and receive data. The whole point of creating this asynchronous function is that it will continuously stream data at the rate of the number of frames that we actually specified and send it on to assembly AI's web socket. So let's go ahead and copy this function right here. And once we've actually uh, copied that function, we actually need to run it. So we're going to copy asyncure.run. Uh, but one thing that you guys should do is actually change this auth key. This auth key right here is actually your API ID. So copy auth key over here and paste your API ID right here. So you can go back to your home page, click to copy and paste your API ID and you can remove this import statement. So now we just save this file and open terminal and open terminal and you can run by issuing commands like python live text.py. Hi guys. Hi guys, I'm Smitha and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see, this is actually doing live inscription of whatever I'm saying. So guys, let me know what you guys thought about this tutorial and definitely try this out for yourself. This is extremely fun. So guys, be sure to check out the links to Assembly AI's website, their cool API and a lot of other tutorials like this to build cool applications using their API on their website as well. And thank you guys for watching. Hope this video was helpful and see you in my next one.